Hi, I'm Pete, CEO at Elemental. We make Dagster an open source data orchestrator, and I want to welcome you to our event today focused on DBT. But before we get into all the content, I wanted to first touch on something that we care very deeply about here, which is data engineering. And we view data engineering as a discipline, not a job title. So there are all sorts of different people in the, in the organization. They have titles like data engineer or machine learning engineer, data platform engineer, analytics engineer, even data scientist and data analyst. They are all often participating in the process of building, maintaining, and leveraging data pipelines. And so we view this as a discipline, not a job title. And the state of this discipline of data engineering um, today is, is, has a lot of challenges. So first, there's a lot of different tools. So everyone participating in this process has to learn multiple tools. They have to jump through many of them in order to do their job. The second issue is that each of these tools don't provide enough context to truly understand what's going on. And so you often have to leverage a bunch of different tools, maybe write some custom analysis in order to really figure out the state of your data pipeline. The third problem is that there are multiple different data teams within the organization. Often they have the, the title of ML engineers, analytics engineers, data engineers, and they often have entirely different stacks, which makes them difficult to collaborate, even though they are doing very similar activities and they're often operating on the same data sets and serving similar, if not the same stakeholders. Um, so this siloing has a bunch of different problems and creates a lot of problems. And finally, many of the tools that data engineers or people that are practicing the discipline of data engineering have available to them have a really low quality developer experience. So often they're lacking local development. We see teams testing in production all the time. Version control and CICD are often not ubiquitously adopted. And so that's why we started the Dagster project to accelerate the adoption of software engineering best practices and solve a lot of these other problems that we were seeing uh, amongst folks that were practicing the discipline of data engineering. So just a quick recap for those that are not familiar with Dagster uh, to set the table. With Dagster, it's a data orchestrator. So you write and you test your data pipelines in Python. You might be either doing you know, your, your raw compute and transformations within Python, or you might be orchestrating systems outside of Python you know, based on SQL or Scala or another language like that. But fundamentally, you're defining your, your data pipelines in Python and you're testing them locally and, and um, you know, in the CSE process. Uh, then Dagster will run and monitor your computation for you. So you can launch runs. Dagster will monitor them and restart them when they fail. You can put your data pipelines on a schedule. You can kick off runs of data pipelines based on external signals using a feature called sensors. You can partition them, etc. Dexter will run them for you and it will give you a beautiful UI to monitor, the, monitor that computation and also hook up to alerting systems to let you know when something's going wrong. And then finally, um, one of our distinguishing features is that we track data lineage and metadata within the tool itself. So you can inspect every asset status, its schema, its metadata, and its de dependencies all from one place really, really convenient for engineers working on the data platform, as well as their stakeholders to kind of self-identify self issues, you know, when they come up. A lot of people are using Dagster, all sorts of different companies all over the world, all sorts of different industries and sizes and stages. Um, and we integrate with uh, every data tool out there, basically. Um, and uh, one thing that we noticed was that one integration really rose above the rest in terms of adoption within the Dagster community. And that was DBT. So over half of our cloud users use DBT in at least one of their pipelines. And so DBT has become one of our most important integrations. And that's why we have spent the last couple of months really focusing on making a lot of improvements to our integration and, and really uh, trying to set the standard for orchestration uh, with DBT. And so I wanted to share our, our agenda with you today. So uh, Pedram is gonna take over from me and he's gonna talk about the challenges that organizations are facing um, you know, with DBT at scale. Sandy's gonna make the case that Dagster is the best way to orchestrate DBT, and I agree with him. Then Rex is going to do a demo of our new DBT integration. And then finally, Ben is going to show us what this enables in terms of kind of the current set of features that Dagster has and the future of Dagster and how DBT can plug into that and leverage all the great features that everybody using, um, using Dagster uh, has been able to take advantage of so far.